While we're on the topic of boobs, um, I just want to get this out of the way. Motorboating, guys. We need to stop it. <laughs> Sir, have you ever motorboated someone? Absolutely. You're a real jerk, just so you know that. I don't understand where men got the idea to do this. Like, why? What are you trying to accomplish? Just so you know, never in the history of womankind has one woman said to another, oh my God, Jenny, you are not gonna believe what Jim did to me last night. Oh, he took his face, he put it between my breasts, and then he blew bubbles. Oh, oh, I, oh my God, I had no idea my sternum had a clit. Oh. But there I was, just squirting all over the place. <laughs> Best orgasm I've ever had. That's never happened, guys. That's never, no woman wants that. And also, you definitely can't motorboat me. You'll bottom out on the lake bed. Um, <laughs> have you bottomed out on a lake bed before, sir? <laughs> Man, boobs are great. Women are just kind of magical. Boobs, no boobs. We're just kind of magical, mystical creatures, and I really love that about us. Thank you. Thank you. I was really pandering to the women in the audience, so thank you. I appreciate that. I just, I think we're like witches, and I mean that in the best way possible, because if we're not witches, then if you explain to me why if we spend more than one month together, we all get our period at the same time. <laughs> That's like witch shit. It's not like we discuss it. It's not like I'm like, Erica, Renee, Becky, on three, let's bleed. <laughs> There's no discussion of it, ever, never. But like right now, at this very moment, every single lady body in the room is sending out an underground railroad message <laughs> to every other lady in the room. It's like, do 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 Right now, our uteruses are just reaching out for each other, joining hands. <laughs> And they're like, Red Rover, Red Rover. <laughs> Don't send anyone over. Unless they have dark chocolate. <laughs> like, that's witch shit. That is witchery, you know? What happens if men spend a month together? What, you start a fantasy football league? <laughs> yeah, we make, we make people inside our body. That's fucking magical. I love it when men are like, you know, we're 50% of the equation, and I'm like, you're bad at math. <laughs> oh, you show up to a cookie-making party with a stick of butter, and we have the rest of the ingredients and the oven to make the cookies? <laughs> Maybe just, like, pump the brakes with your condiment. It's melting, you know? <laughs> I'll leave you with this, speaking of a melting condiment. Um, there's this awful rumor going around that pineapple is supposed to make a man's <laughs> taste better. I'm trying to do this joke without saying the word cum, but... <laughs> cum. Have you heard this rumor? It's a horrible rumor. Rumors are started by people who directly benefit from them. And I've thought long and hard about this one in particular, and I figured out who came up with this rumor. It was the CEO of Dole Pineapple. <laughs> one quarter, sales were down. And he was like, big meeting, corporate meeting. He's like, what are we going to do, guys? What are we going to do? <laughs> There's creepy guy Joe in accounting. He's like, I have an idea. <laughs> Joe got fired, but they ran with it. <laughs> And just so you know, the only way a man's cum is ever gonna taste better because of pineapple is if it's literally served on a piece of pineapple and then we brush it all off. <laughs> and then we throw it on the ground because we don't want to swallow any more of your lies. 